Good morning and welcome to a Monday vlog. I am in New York City and I'm here for the YouTuber Creator Conference. Or no, that's not right. YouTube Creator Summit. It's the second one they've ever done. There's a lot of big YouTubers here. Uh, so I'm going to bring you guys along uh, for the day as part of today's Monday vlog. It's not really gaming related, but I don't think I would have been invited if I didn't have a gaming channel, so here we go. I am here and I am with Lizzie. Oh, and Joey. And Joey. I was waiting for my introduction before I could speak. And Joey! Joey Grisepa! That's right. Hi! Thank you. Address me by my full username. How are you? Lizzie, how are you? I'm good. I'm scared. I don't know what we're doing. Why are you scared? Do you know what we're doing? Well, no, but I'm not scared about it. Hello to us. There's a lot of YouTubers here. Like, I'm just going to do a pan of the room just so you can see, like, all of the... I have a kid-friendly channel, man! Okay, blur this out. You ready for this? Oh, I was in! Wow! My little two seconds. Okay, Joey has been hypnotized apparently. I was out talking to someone in YouTube and he is like out. The more tears, the more noise you make. The better these guys will feel, the better they'll feel, the deeper they'll go, the deeper they'll go, the better the show. Uh, should anybody ever ask your name, it's completely E-I-E-I-O, not even if you understand. That's your first name, always was and always will be. What was your name? E-I-E-I-O. <laughs> Just say your first name, your middle name, and your last name. E-I-E-I-O. Michael Grisafa. <laughs> Joey has recovered, I think. Yeah. Joey, what's your name? Joey. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, well, how many floors are we going up? I know, how many? What's happening? Why did they tell us to take the stairs Joey instead of the elevator? Person. Okay, so we're doing like this competition where we have to make tacos. Yes, yeah, I don't know. I don't eat gluten or beans. <laughs> Can she be the stylist instead of me? Two people. Okay, okay. Santa should be at Look, it's Rich. I love you. I love everything. I'm going to the table because I'm not tall enough to be seen by Slipknot. Queen. Um, totally. You know, I'm so shocked uh, to get an invite to come here today to, to chat with you guys because so many of you are so much more successful than I was back in the day when I was your ages. I was still working in, in restaurants and unloading trucks and cooking up 60 pounds of uh, protein and two veg in a soup a day, that kind of thing. <laughs> but um, I can say it's an honor to be here and that it's such a cool day, time, and place and world to live in because the whole world is accessible to you guys. You can make your own brand as fast as you can film yourselves telling a truthful story. And I think that's really the key of the only story I have to tell about the reason our brand is successful. You have to keep it real. You have to understand, that especially if you're talking about food or home or <laughs> private lives, that it has to begin with your life, and you have to let people in and be honest about who you are and what you are promising. Okay, we lost, but I think Louise and I are friends now. Forever. Forever. She's a real winner. She's a real winner. I had popcorn and a strawberry. It was delicious. Okay, I have been doing the worst job vlogging, but some of this stuff it's like weird to vlog in, right? Because you're actually, like I've been meeting with YouTube employees who have been giving like presentations on like comments and how they can improve commenting and um, you know, original programming and YouTube Red and uh, virtual reality and 360 and all of this stuff. So it hasn't really been something I can vlog, but now, I'm going out to YouTube's like brand cast presentation where they show like advertisers what they're working on. Um, it should be fun. And I'm gonna go meet up with Lizzie. I don't know if I'll see anyone else, but um, but yeah, let's go. Oh my gosh, this fan came for Lizzie. It's so cute. Okay, so this is like a big event that I did not know about. And 
like look at this. I didn't know, like I'm supposed to dress up. I'm like, oh, no. I know. I didn't know there was a red carpet. I didn't know any of this, but it's kind of cool. All right, let's go. I don't. We don't know what's happening right now, but Big Bird's here. I'm more of a Grover girl. experience right so we're in the audience and this guy is presenting and all of a sudden like an alarm beep and then like it goes off so everyone's like oh that was weird and then an alarm beeps again and a guy comes over the end of comment says there has been a hazardous material so then these air vents, these giant air vents that go across the whole room, like one of them just like shuddered and something like moved the whole way across. And it happened twice. And like the guy that was talking didn't say anything. And we were like, is everyone gonna ignore this? And then all of a sudden like everyone started leaving. No, no, nobody left. No, 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 I, okay, not everybody. Like. Like a few people, like people definitely started leaving from the back, but all the like YouTube people and everything just sat there. So we were like, what's going on? And Lizzie was like, I want out. And I'm like, let's go. So we left and it was nothing. Stay safe in a fire, evacuate calmly. Good words, Lizzie, that's good advice. Yes, you can never be too safe. And mom, if you're watching this, you raised Right. Well, Daniel and I are really living our best life. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you can say the same thing for Joey and Lizzie. Oh, but wait. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh wait, I'm sorry. Is that a plate uh, of eaten biscuits over there? I'm stopped. Just crumbs? I feel like everyone else's iPhone video is better than my iPhone video. I don't know if it's a setting. Like I'm also super close to you. But I'm waiting for Lizzie in the lobby because I'm gonna go try to get a gluten-free crepe. Okay, we got our crepes, and as what happens with everything that's gluten-free, I think yours is going to be delicious, and mine's <laughs> going to be like, mm, it's okay. Let's try a bite. Yeah, Lizzie just said like, oh, it looks like a chocolate crepe. No, it's buckwheat. <laughs> How's it taste? Like buckwheat. <laughs> Look at this fancy car that they sent. I'm sharing a ride home with Felix and Jack. Oh, there's, there they are with their entourage. So I completely forgot, but I am actually, oh gosh, I'm actually going to be surprising Emmy, who follows me on Twitter and has been like one of my longest time potato flakes. Uh, I told her where I was gonna be and she's gonna come and I get to like say hi to her. Hello, I'm here now with Emmy. Hi. Hello, this is my super fan. You wore blue and white stripes. And what's really cool is actually she brought artwork that she drew me th three years ago? Three years. three years ago, cause she's been like a viewer, a potato flake for that long. Okay, so let me see. This one is my favorite one. Okay, let's see here. Wow. Stand on a school lunch table, cause that'd be embarrassing. Yeah. What's the, oh the knife game is, oh. Oh gosh, well I'm <laughs> really. <laughs> I'm really glad that you didn't have to do any of those things. Yeah. <laughs> I, I kind of <laughs> when I was coming to New York, I knew I had to tweet Emmy because she's always tweeted such positive things to me and always said that I should come to New York and tell her when I'm in New York. So I was like, okay, I'm, I'm in New York. Did. Was that weird? I, I was sitting on the couch just because my Twitter notifications don't work anymore and I opened them up thinking it was just like someone and I opened it and I was like, oh, and I thought it was fake. And I went to my mother and was like, uh, I want you to read this before I say anything because I'm kind of scared. Like you thought I'd been hacked or something? I, I thought that, but then I was like, I don't think that if a hacker came in, they would try to get one person to meet you at an airport unless someone like had That's help. true, that's really random. Thank yeah. you for coming to the airport. It was no problem at all, if you ask me. Um, I, I had no problem being here. <laughs> Okay, cool. Well, I'm gonna go like hang out with Emmy some more, so bye. Okay, I am going to give Emmy a sneak peek at my newest dog craft poster and see what her take on it is. I'm excited to see. All right, come here. All right, 
Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye, Emmy. Goodbye. It was so nice to meet you. Super fan. <laughs> I'll put Emmy's Twitter in the, in the description. I'm so tired. I slept the entire plane ride home, but I'm really excited to see Milk. I won't get the dogs till tomorrow, but I'm really excited to see him and see how he reacts. Hi. Oh, did you make a mess down here? Hi. I missed you. Hi, boy. Hey. I didn't leave you forever. Is that what you thought? I think someone's happy that I'm home. Hi, sweetheart. Hi, my boy. All right, guys. This was such a random vlog. Oh, he does this stretch thing when I hold him. All right, this was such a random vlog. I will see you next time, but until then, uh, Paige and Molly love you. Go rescue a dog.